and glad you are watching The Dish on this Friday. Okay, be prepared for any emergency that may come your way by going to an upcoming expo this summer. And joining us now for the sponsored interview is Chris Turpin, the director of the Be Prepared Expo this year. Welcome, Chris. Oh, thank you for having me. Okay, so everything that we need to prepare and survive, certain number of days or an event of a catastrophe. Yeah, and it we'll have everything at the expo from someone who is just a, a beginning preparer all the way to someone who's in foxholes on Saturday afternoons, you know. So anything, because <clears throat> a little bit of preparedness is always better than none. Chris, I like that you're helping us be really prepared because this isn't till June. So put it on your calendar. This is June 2nd and June 3rd, 3rd in Farmington at the Legacy Event Center. This is your second annual. It is. What can people expect when they walk in the door? Vendors? Yes, we're going to have plenty of vendors and tons of giveaways. Anything that you need to have. Um, some of our big sponsors like Darren Bedeau RV, they're giving, we're going to be giving away a 20 to 22 foot uh, RV. Uh, Goldbacks from goldback.com. Uh, we also like to uh, uh, put a shout out to Be Ready Utah. They, they combined with us, so the state agency Be Ready Utah is with us this year too. And Chris, what are we preparing for? What are the different scenarios of why we would want to go to your expo? Well, you want to prepare for anything from uh, a total catastrophe or, or it could be flooding this year, right? If you need to leave your home, for a certain amount of time, 72 hours, or if someone gets hurt, um, you want to know what you need to be prepared, right? Uh, in any type of an emergency, could be your car stalls out and you're in a snowbank. You know, what do you have in your car that can help you? It's definitely top of mind for mm -hmm. a lot of people, especially this year. Why are you so passionate about it? Well, I, I just want to be out there and, and help people and give them the opportunity. To, to prepare. I mean, that's really all you can do is, is, is give them the opportunity, then they can choose. Uh, I know last year everyone was very happy and we have tons of classes uh, that will be offered and from various speakers, we'll have speakers on stage in the main expo center and then we have uh, classes running both days every hour uh, along with giving away a, some sort of a gift every hour. And I think being prepared is so important. For example, when we went through the earthquake, I don't think we were prepared enough. And I think the last thing you want is to be prepared the day of a catastrophe, right? Yeah, if something happens and you're not prepared, it's already too late, right? And that's why we say preparedness helps you from eating your neighbor. <laughs> Which no one wants to do. No, no, no one wants to eat their no, neighbor. Not a good idea. Is there a class yeah. on that, Chris? Uh, there, there actually is going to be a class on not eating your neighbor. Yeah. Really? Yeah. For a zombie well, apocalypse, right? Zombie apocalypse, yes. That definitely caught my attention. <laughs> Should you be getting tickets now? Can you get them at the door? Tell people how they can go. You can get tickets at, at uh, BePreparedExpo.com. You can also get them on the door. But if you get them early, you save $2. It's $8 per person or $20 per family of four on Pre Be Prepared Expo. Well, prepare now, uh, June 2nd and 3rd at the Legacy Event Center right there in Farmington. Second annual, bigger and better this year than last year. That's correct. Chris, good luck. Thank you so Take much. Take care. Thank Appreciate you for it. being on the show. Thank and you. thanks again to Be Prepared Expo for sponsoring this interview. Still ahead on The Daily Dish, are you in the mood for a movie based on history or a thriller? We're telling you what's worth watching this weekend. Not only that, let's celebrate Earth Day with some sustainable products. We're sharing more about Icelandic salts that are Gordon Ramsay approved when we 